Welcome to the College of Medicine, Qatar University. Problem-based learning is an important student-centered learning approach at the core of our educational strategy. We have developed and implemented an online simulation system transforming the written PBL scenarios into interactive patient encounters. Now we focus more on Africa, like, uh, like malaria and people. He just feel that he has fever. So history is important. You won't jump into a physical examination. Yes. Okay. So now I have the ability to ask specific questions to the patient in a face-to-face -face conversation. He have fever and muscle cramps and sore throat and he said that it's the first time to experience uh, this thing. No, ask about the drugs first, no problem. Ask about the drugs. Yeah. Did you take any medication? I can observe the patient and feel him as well in the same time. The depression stage and the last one is the, the month, acceptance. Month, yeah, with the, with the with Dr. Ne Tanya. Uh, Actually, made me uh, made it easier to interact with the patient. As a doctor, it's very important to see patients' reaction, not just to uh, it, it, to see what they feel after you say something. So uh, during the VPL, if we click on some option we can actually see the changing expression of the patient and we can see that he's feeling uneasy or he's feeling good about it or he's comfortable interacting with us or not. So this VPL system makes us interact better with patients so uh, we will be um, more ready to interact with patients than uh, other students who use the traditional system. What I really liked about the VPL is that it makes the learning process more interactive between the students and another thing is that it makes uh, you imagine the patient as a real human being instead of just reading and you move a patient on a piece of paper it makes you imagine him as a real person which really helps the students to learn more about uh, how to deal with patients in the future. When we were introduced to the VPL which is virtual patient learning I was amazed by the way this is done. I never thought that there will be a new way that makes us interact with the patient and see his facial expressions and see his body language from now. So before that we were only dealing with papers, reading papers. But in the future we will not read papers. We will see people in front of us, we will see humans with facial expressions, with different languages and with different ways in exp explaining their problems. VPL teaches us, a student, how to properly uh, reach for the patient, especially in terms of delivering bad news. I believe that this is a very interesting way for students to learn from the beginning of their medical, uh, medical uh, studies. I wish that one day we even can see a real patient at the same time who can interact with us in a very uh, real way. We believe that virtual patient learning will be the future of problem-based learning.